let's jump right in. Once our background is inserted onto our timeline, adjust the length you'd like to have it run for by click and dragging the end of the clip in or out. I'm happy with it being around 4 seconds. Perfect. Now we'll want to make sure effects is toggled on by coming up and selecting effects from the top left. Then come down to the toolbox menu and select titles. From here, go ahead and choose text plus. Click and drag this onto video track 2 on your timeline like so. The text will now appear on top of your background, but it currently looks a little sad and out of place. So go ahead and click on your text layer until it highlights red and then come up to the inspector tab on the right. And then if you come down, you'll see a text box. Delete that and type in what you'd like your effect to be called. I'll simply call it Digital Glitch. So let's come down and change the font first. And download this font, which can be used commercially for free. If you look under Fusion Effects, you'll see one called Digital Glitch. We're going to click and drag this right on top of our text layer like so. If we play it back now, as you see, it looks super cool. 